Shalom, God bless you. I welcome you in the name of Jesus. You're welcome to this awesome session. God bless you. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. This man said, you are his wife. And he prayed to God and mentioned this before God. Men know what they want, okay? Men know who their wives are. If you're with a man and you have dated him for one, two, or three years, and he's not saying anything, it's a red flag, please ask this person, why are you still with me? Why are you still with me? If he doesn't give you any tangible reason, quit the relationship and believe God for your spouse to come. Men know who their wives are and they know who they want. A man will not take you and keep you for a long period of time. All in the name of, I don't have money, I want to achieve my goal. I want. If a man loves you, he definitely will be scared to get married to you as soon as possible. In order for other men not to come and take you from him. Okay? The truth about it is, they know. It's not all about the money. If you tell God today that you want to get married and the both of you are into it, everything is going to work out. Help will come from above. Help will come from left and right. People will come together. And you will be so shocked that a wedding will be so successful. That is the reason why a man can date a lady for five, four, six, seven years. Then I will get to meet another lady. It's, they don't. They, they, they did not even get into one year or two years into courtship and you hear that they are married. It's because they know who they want to settle down with. Don't go and get yourself stuck in a relationship. Believing God that this man is going to settle down with me, I'm, I'm understanding when it is time, will definitely come. No, honey, do not do that. Don't you do that. If you start noticing, no, it's not saying anything one year, two years, three years, you are good enough, you have already proven yourself. And there's nothing you should be hiding by that time. Let him marry you. If he's not willing to get married to you, good and fine. Let him go so that your man can come. I pray for you on that grace. May God help you to be able to make such a decision. You should be able to be conscious about your marital settlement. I pray for you. God is touching the heart of someone that has been keeping you in a relationship and does not want to settle down with you because of one excuse or the other. God is fixing things for you in the mighty name of Jesus. In Jesus' precious name, amen. God bless you. I love you. Shalom.